welcome back to Let's Play Amberstar. We are in the city of Crystal in the tavern called the Jewel. A man with black beard and a patch over one eye speaks to you. Hello, good people. I am Captain Briggs. Have you perhaps seen Orlando? I have just sailed into the harbor and am unlaid and am unloading the wine he ordered. And who are you? I hear nothing. A young man with a three-day beard that speaks to you. Hello, my name is Karsten. Are you here because of the cook speciality? It is on the menu, but I always come too late. There's nothing left. I have come to think that the cook is eating it all himself. Who are you? A middle-aged woman looks at you and says, Are you perhaps looking for my husband, the landlord? If so, go through the kitchen door to the south. It leads to a to a, it leads to a corridor. Then take the right hand door. You will find Orlando in the courtyard behind it. Who are you? I hear nothing, but who are you? The man before you stands six foot tall and has a bed. That, as you speak to him, he turns to you and says, Hello, I'm Eric, the jewels, co the jewels cook. Would you like to try one of my specialities? Curry chicken, wait. I will bring some plates. Eric goes to one of the large pans in the kitchen, but then comes back empty-handed. I'm really very sorry, but there's nothing left. Perhaps you can't come again. Well, uh, no, I can't. And I'm looking for a place. God heaven, no. I'm looking for a place. Yeah, no, not here. There. Through this door. This door. Alright. Um, on this door hangs a sign, guest house reception. Hmm, not here. Are you maybe the paladin I'm looking for? Or um, wanna be paladin? Yes, you are, Graven. Hello, welcome. My name is Gryben. Have you come to Crystal to join the Guild of Paladins? Paladins? It is my greatest, wi greatest wish to become a paladin, to wear shining armor, to carry a bright sword, and, if to, uh, and to defend the good against the evil. But unfortunately, I will never get the gold together which I need to join the guild. But you can join us. Yes, naturally. How long have I already been waiting to get out of here? Would it be too much if I ask you, ask you, asked you to have me trained as a paladin? No, it would not. You are welcome aboard. Even though I don't really like you. As you go through the door, you are suddenly outside in the open air. This seems to be the garden of the house. We will get back there later, but we are looking for somebody. In this room, you see an unusually large number of plants. Shelves are fixed to the walls everywhere and support many species of plants. Many large plants pot plant pl many large plant pots filled with flowers stand around the floor. In a corner of the room, you can see a small gnome who is lovingly caring for one of the many plants. And you are party member number four. We need you. Oh, um, he does not understand me. Maybe he understands Silk. No, maybe Gryven. All right, Olfin. Oh no, you are not the one I'm looking for. I was wrong. I'm looking for somebody else. 
But a gnome, I think he is too. I'm not sure, but I think he is. But where can I find him? Maybe here? Ah, oh yeah, you could, you could be it. No, you are an old hag. The ol oh, the old man sits in the grass and looks to the trees. When he notices you, he begins to speak. Have you, pe have you perhaps seen Calvin, the bard? Normally he used to come here once a week and play the old songs on his beautiful harp. But I have not seen him for months. I hope nothing has happened to him. Of course something happened to him. If you already suggest that, as you enter this room you immediately notice the large pictures hanging on the wall. Each one shows a landscape and a brilliant white gate. Uh, no. We are not looking for you, we are looking for somebody else. But where? Maybe here? Yes, that's the one. Now he's sleeping? Yeah. No, not anymore. Hello. No, he's a half elf, not, not a gnome. You want to join us? Hello. Hello, I'm Tresterick, the Black Wiz. Uh, I mean, the Grain Merchant. Can I help you? Black Wizard. So loud, we are not very popular at the moment, and I don't want to tempt the people to think about lynching. Since Marmion went mad and attacked the eternal gods, gods, we are being hunted again. It is really bad, but what can one do? Our guild is always falling into disrepute. Are any of you interested in joining the guild? You look very trustworthy, and I will therefore tell you where I have hidden the key which will free the gate to the Tower of the Guild. Search for the key in one of Olfin's flower pots. You will find the guild in a valley to the southeast of Leramion. The coordinates of the tower are X 265 Y 306. You will need a shed because the valley is surrounded by the high Bolga mountains Bolga Berge, which reach far out into the sea. I have heard that the dwarfs here in Crystal build very good ships. Dwarfs. Never mind. Perhaps you should take a look there. Perhaps, but you are coming with us. Hmm, yes, you are right. I should try to save my... To sh no, I should try to save the reputation of my guild and fight Marmion. Have you already got the key to the guild from one of the flower pots in Olfin's room? If not, let us go and get it. Though, Gaza, we can free the pass to the tower of the guild with the sphere. The guild is to be found in a valley, blah blah blah, we have that. We will need one if we want blah 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 blah. Alright. Now our group is complete for the first quest. But we want to get this key first. And we will get it in the next video. And then we go back to Twin Lake.